hello hello so um today's video i'm going to talk about how much weight does emotions hold or do emotions hold um so one example we all know of and we've all had an experience something similar to it in our life i'm sure most of us have anyway um is when you receive some really bad news or something really traumatic happens and you're told about it and people will often say oh my gosh when I heard that it was like I got hit by a truck or I got hit by a car or I was so like I couldn't breathe or so the power of that emotion takes over you and takes over your space your energetic space and takes up part of that space and normally, like I mentioned in previous videos, we're meant to process that. And then our body will release it because we've we've accepted it. We've gone through whatever we need to and we've processed it. And occasionally something will happen to interrupt that process and we won't be able to process it. And we will end up carrying that around. And if you think of the weight of that emotion, like the um, the impact that it had in the beginning to continue carrying it around you can compare that to having some heavy thing that you have to to carry around and haul around all the time and how much that affects your body. So if you were to pick up a sack of potatoes, <laughs> just to say, and carry that around in the beginning, it's, you know, it's heavy, but you're like, it's not that bad. But if you were to carry it all the time, like constantly for the whole day, a week, a month, all day, every day, it would get really, really heavy. And then it would just weigh on you more and more because you're, you've are you got to always have it with you. You've got to always carry it with you. You've got to manage to juggle everything else you're taking with you and that. And then all of a sudden, if one day you were able to put that down and not have to carry it with you anymore, imagine the difference of not having to carry around a 10 pound sack of potatoes, some great big heavy thing that you've had to juggle other things around that has been something you've had to burden yourself with and carry everywhere you've been, how much lighter you would feel. So when you talk about the weight of the emotions, how much of a relief that would be. And that's what it's like for your system and for your body when you release a trapped emotion, especially a powerful one, um, something that has been very overwhelming or that was very um, shocking to your system at the start. So weight of emotions, how much weight do they carry? That is sort of an anecdotal way of explaining how much emotions can weigh us down. 